Thank you for choosing MedQuip for your respiratory needs. We appreciate your business. If your physician has recommended taking a respiratory medication with a compressor nebulizer system, please watch this video for instructions on how to properly use it. Compressor nebulizer systems provide air pressure that works with your nebulizer cup to turn liquid medications into a fine mist. This allows the medication to go directly into your lungs. Always wash your hands before setting up your nebulizer. Place your nebulizer on a hard surface, such as a table or countertop. Plug your nebulizer into an electrical outlet. Make sure the vents on either side of the unit are not blocked to allow necessary airflow into the compressor. Connect one end of the tubing to your compressor and the other end of the tubing to the bottom of the medication cup. Open your medication cup by twisting the lid and add the medication prescribed by your healthcare provider. Make sure you add the medication along the side and not down the center of the cup. Replace the top on the medication cup. Then connect either a mouthpiece or mask attachment to the medication cup. Do not lay the medication cup on its side. This will cause the medication to spill. You are now ready to begin your treatment. To begin your treatment, turn the power switch to the on position. The nebulizer will turn the medication into a mist. Place the mouthpiece in your mouth, or if you are using a mask, place the mask over your nose and mouth. Be sure to sit upright and remain relaxed. It is important to breathe through your mouth and not through your nose. This will ensure that the medication gets into your lungs. Take two or three slow deep breaths in between each normal breath. If you must stop before completing the entire treatment, turn off the compressor. Depending on the type of nebulizer you have, treatment time should take anywhere from 8 to 15 minutes. You will notice a sputtering sound and will no longer be able to see the mist when the treatment is complete. It is okay if there are a few drops of medicine still in the cup. When your treatment is complete, turn off your compressor by turning the power switch to the off position. Then unplug the unit. The medication cup and mouthpiece or mask needs to be cleaned between each treatment. Disconnect the mask or any other patient accessory interface and disassemble the medication cup. These pieces can be cleaned by simply using one part distilled white vinegar and three parts warm water. Do not clean or rinse the tubing. Rinse all of the components with warm water and lay aside to air dry away from direct sunlight. Remember to check your nebulizer's air filters often. Change out the filter regularly depending on how many treatments you do each day. A dirty filter will affect the efficiency of your treatment and or the lifetime of your compressor. If you have any questions, please contact your local medical supply store. Keep in mind that these instructions are compatible with any of MedQuip's compressor nebulizers, adult or pediatric. Here at MedQuip, we hope that this instructional video has simplified setting up and using your compressor nebulizer system. Again, thank you for your business.